Cargo Trailers. We are at our dealership located in Douglas, Georgia, and we just had this beautiful motorcycle trailer I wanted to show you guys that just came offline. It is available. Guys, it won't last long with these upgrades on it. Um, these trailers are hard to find in stock, but we got it here for you um, at Douglas, Georgia, renowned cargo trailers. I'm gonna go around and show y'all a little bit about this trailer. It is an eight and a half by 24. I believe it is 24, yeah. Eight and a half by 24, black. Um, it has a slanted V-nose on the front. If you'll see, the V-nose is slanted down. We cover the top up with black ATP. It's got your extended triple tube tongue on the front. Guys, what this helps you do is keeps you from jackknifing your trailer. It also helps you be able to turn tighter radiuses and just maneuver the trailer better. It also adds more integrity to the trailer. You've got a, a beam running down the center as well, and it is a triple tube extended tongue. If you'll look, this trailer's done in all black. It's got our blackout special on it. So when you do the blackout special, all your trim's done in black. You get your nice alloy wheels, and then you get these nice aluminum sidewall vents right here. You never have to worry about the sun cracking them, so you never have to worry about anything leaking. After about three years, I can't stop it, especially if it's not covered up or up under a shelter, that sun's gonna crack that roof vent, you're gonna have to replace it. So we've got the nicer upgraded aluminum sidewall vents. We mount one on the uh, driver's side up here at the top and one on the passenger side at the lower rear, at the rear of the trailer. You open them up, it'll suck all the gas fumes out of the trailer, creates a crosswind. It's just a real nice vent on the trailer. So this trailer is done in polycore. Guys, if you'll look down the side of it, this is a hot, sunny day in South Georgia. And you can see how flat this uh, exterior is laying. A lot of times you'll see black trailers go down the road. They look like a wrinkled up potato chip bag. I don't care um, if you upgrade it to 030, sometimes you still get that look, um, especially on your dark color trailers, black trailers, charcoal cray. But this is a polycore exterior. Um, it is 080 material. If you come around here, Laura, and look on this side of it, you can see how thick that is. That is 080, it's 080 polycore. Guys, this is the future of cargo trailers. Um, so, especially if you're worried about cosmetics, it just makes your trailer look super nice and lay flat. What we've got also, we've got a semi-screwless exterior on this trailer. How we do that, we, uh, we screw it in the seams, and glue it in the middle. You can see it's not flimsy, that's durable stuff. Also, when you do a polycore, we do this um, ATP on the front corners and the rear corners as well. We've got 5,200 pound axles on this trailer. These are torsion axles. On your torsion axles, they're a little more expensive, um, but you pay for what you get. They're gonna pull better, they're gonna absorb shock better, they just ride better. Um, this trailer's gonna be hauling motorcycles for somebody one day, and you don't want your motorcycles or your race cars bouncing up and down. We've got E-Track in the trailer, you'll see in a second, and uh, so it creates a smoother ride. You also get 11 years of warranty compared to a six year warranty on your drop leaf spring axles. When you upgrade to torsion, you get 11 years of warranty. Also, on this trailer, you'll see we've got the spread axle pattern. You'll notice that the axles are spread out a little bit. You can only do that upgrade if you do a torsion axle. You can't spread the axles out with a drop leaf spring axle. Here's the ATP wrapped on the rear corners that I was talking about, black diamond plate. When you do polycore, you gotta wrap the front corners and the rear corners. Also, we've got your uh, upgraded LED brake lights here. They look really nice and they light it up well. Y'all, this is our new sales rep. Let me introduce him. This is Chad Abels, newest guy to the team. He's going he's gonna to be an MVP all-star for Renowned Cargo. I can already tell, so y'all give Chad a call if you're interested in the trailer. If you'll look at the bottom, uh, we've got the floor wrapped in the uh, extended flat, wrapped in RTP. This is rubber tread plate flooring. Guys, it's very durable. It creates a non-slip uh, resistant. So when you're going in and out of the trailer, if it's raining or something, you're not gonna slip and fall down. We also got an uh, LED loading light up here, 12 volt light. If you're ever loading your motorcycles at night, uh, that light will help you be able to see better if you're coming in and out of the trailer. So on the inside, we've got these 19 inch uh, LED 
uh, lights as well in the cove of the wall. They're mounted at a 45 degree angle. They just look cool and give you some lighting. They're 12 volt, so they're wired to that 12 volt battery right there. And we also have it wired triple charge. So when you're going down the road, it's gonna charge that battery when you're plugged into your truck. We've got silver uh, metal walls on the interior of the trailer, silver metal ceiling. If you look at our E-Track, it's welded to the frame. It ain't going nowhere and it's recessed in the floor. So it's recessed in the floor, welded to the frame, and then we trim it out real nice for you with aluminum, make it look real nice. Also, uh, we've got some D-rings in this trailer. So if you want to tie down to the D-rings, we put them in there, we give them to you on eight and a half wide trailers, six, six wides and seven wides. At rock solid, you get four D-rings. Um, we've got three rows of E-Track. What I love about the E-Track is you're not limited to where you have to tie down or strap down to. So if they're putting motorcycles in here, they want to put one up to the front, county corner one, whatever. They're not limited to those D-rings that are going to be uh, just in that stationary position. You got plenty of places to tie down to. You just put a J-clip in there and then you run your straps through the J-clip. You can move the clip around and then strap down your bike or your car. This trailer is not gonna last long. Another thing that I like is we moved the side door in this trailer. We got the side door mounted on the passenger side v -nose. A lot of people like that, so you've got wall space over here, and then you can come in and out of the trailer through the front of the v -nose. Very nice feature. So guys, we built this trailer. We took one up to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina for bike week. We took a seven by 16 up there. And a lot of people were asking us, do y'all make them bigger? So we built this bigger trailer for somebody because a lot of people was inquiring about it. It is in stock. You can give us a call and buy it today. Like today's Wednesday, this trailer will probably be gone by next Wednesday. It'll, it'll, maybe it'll last that long. So if y'all are interested, y'all give us a call. 188-287-3954. You can also find us on our website at renownedcargotrailers.com, TikTok, Racing Junk, um, Craigslist. We're real easy to find out there. Laura does an amazing job with our marketing, but guys, we look forward to earning y'all's business. This trailer is beautiful. We wanted to show it to you, and we want to thank you for watching our videos. We also want to tell you Jesus loves you. If you don't get nothing else out of this video, I do hope you know that Jesus loves you right where you're at. And um, I thank God that he redeemed my life. And if he'll do it for me, he'll do the same for you. Guys, thanks again for watching our videos. We look forward to earning your business soon. And y'all know the rest. Until then, y'all be blessed.